to my channel and I am super 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 excited to share with you my graduation cap design and all of the materials used I purchased from my local Michael Michael's craft store so I'm sure you can get it from any Michael's craft store so I'm just showing you guys a list showing you guys the materials I picked up from Michael so I have the letters and the glitter the flowers for you know little decorations I have the white bow make sure you ask for the white cheerleading bow I have this fabric spray paint is the tulip color shirt short shot and I got it in the color green so I have my exacto blade my tape and my scissors and some Elmer's glue in the clear for my base I got this black lace looking paper material and of course I have my graduation cap which I will be designing so keep watching guys what I'll be doing is spray painting my white bowl so I'm going to I, I'm going to be spray painting it green for those of you who don't know I am from Nigeria and the color of my country's flag is green white green so I just got the idea while I was in the store you know to um, do it for the, do it for the culture you know for my country so I wanted to spray paint this bowl green white green white and green so I'm going in with the tape and covering up the places where I want to be white. So I'm hoping the spray doesn't get to it. But apparently I used the wrong kind of tape and some of the paint still got to it. But it's okay. It's my first time. It's not the end of the world. We're going to work with it. So I'm going in with the tape and I'm taping it as much as I can. I taped it a lot of times. You know, I kept taping and taping until I... I was satisfied with it and I felt like you know the paint wouldn't sip through so I would get that good white and get the color green white green so I'm just gonna play some music and show you guys how you know I achieve this using the fabric thing it's Sam Moki though <laughs> Girl, you gotta understand that I gotta be a man when I see what I want Tell me if you got a plan, put your number in my hand Cause you don't need to front She said she did Call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack This may be the Call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack She said she did feel me She said she did Call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack just they call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack, call me Jack about 30 minutes and go in with my cap so I have this base I got from Michaels of course and it's like a lace material it's weird but it's it's paper but it's a lace material so I'm gonna turn that upside down and cut that hole where you where your tassel goes on top around so I'm gonna cut it it was hard to cut because the lace was kind of like a strong material and had some kind of weird glitter on it but I went in with my scissors and my exacto blade and I made sure I made I cut that hole so it could sit right in it and fit on my cap. So after I got it to work, after a few tries, I finally got it to sit and I actually used a bobby pin around the side to help like tuck in the paper around. It was it was definitely a challenge, but I definitely got it to work so for those of you who don't know I am an interior architecture and design major and that's like my theme for my graduation cap 
so after I got the the bottom no I meant well, after I got the base to sit on the cap I'm going in with this Elmer's glue and gluing it all around before I actually trim the edges and just a heads up that this glue was trash well it's a good glue but just not for fabric or for this paper but I still used it I didn't realize it after I used it so after I pressed it down I took my scissors and I trimmed around the edges and I found that this glue wasn't you know it because after I glued it down the the paper was it, the paper was coming up like you could see the paper was slowly rising it was not staying down basically it was not staying down but here I'm just going in with my scissors and trimming around the edges and yeah <laughs> the paper wasn't actually gluing down to my cap so the Elmer's glue was not working so I went to my local um, Dollar General and I found this fabric glue which said it was good good for fabric it was excellent for fabric for gluing down embellishment on fabric so you know I said why not give it a try because I know a glue gun can get really messy and I gave it a try and it works absolutely wonders can you see the peri perimeters of my cap it worked really really good and I will link it down in my uh, in my description box below so I went ahead and spelled out what I wanted to go on my hat and it says and she divine happily ever after with the flowers around the corners and I went ahead and glued it down with the uh, fabric glue and as for the bow this is how it came out after letting it dry and I tried gluing it down but yeah it was not gluing down so I thought you know for more security I wanted to be secure anyway so I went in with a hair needle and thread a hair not a clothing for but hair a hair needle and thread because the thread are actually really thick and that would give me the security I'm looking for so you know I went in and I kept you know sewing it down and you know working my way around it and putting other little <laughs> decoration next to it but I you know just went in and sewed it down but this is basically what it looks like I'm sorry if you guys can't really hear me you know I'm still working on this whole YouTube thing but this is what the final result looks like this is what the final result looks like I absolutely love it I hope you guys get something from it thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video bye